بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم ان دا نیم آف اللہ ویڈ موسٹ گریشیس اینڈ مرسی فل ویورز ایز یو نو دیٹ آئی ہیو سٹارڈڈ مائی چینل ٹوڈے ایٹ مائی ابجیکٹ ایز جاست ٹو انفارم دا کریکٹ میسیج آف اسلام to the western countries and the people of western countries so that the concept can be cleared whether the Islam is terrorist religion or peaceful religion. First of all, I will discuss about the decorum of Islam. What is the decorum of Islam? How Islam deal with a single person? from birth to death and after death and his again revival so firstly the Islam is spread in this world by our holy prophet that was first agenda of decorum is politeness when you talk with anybody with your soft words polite wordings polite talkings the second person who is facing you will listen you with carefully and you can attract the front man front person who is against you when you will pick the good words, good talking, soft words and politeness there will attract the others to you, towards you and the first object of Islam is politeness. Secondly, Islam circulates others social things for example not to raise your voice someone is talking with you and uh, you are also listening him and you are going into debate you will have to keep your words in your control and you will have to use the such wording wordings that can make you friend not an enemy and you pick such words that can make you near not far and one of them is not to raise your voices and secondly get permission you are going from your own home and you will have to get permission whether you are going whether you are entering your home in your home or your friend home or your relative home you will have to get the permission and next is common sense in the social values for example common thing is that you are going on the road <clears throat> and there is something that is on the road that can be harmful for anybody <clears throat> according to islam is the responsibility of every person should remove that thing from the road so that it cannot be a harmful for the others here the message is very clear when islam allows us when the teachings of islam are that you can remove the harmful thing from the road it is your duty it is your obligation and islam doesn't allow to voice raise your voices 
Islam doesn't allow to enter the uh, house of anybody without any permission. How the Islam can allow anybody to kill him? Brutality, mass care him. Whether he is Muslim or non-Muslim. May Allah bless us the efforts to act upon these indications and signals.